Sunday. It was pretty much of a chilled out day on Sunday. But first of all, went up to Norman's autograph line. Um, but we had a photo op with Cooper at quarter past 11. So we said to the guys who were standing by his line, said, look, we've um, got an autograph with Norman this morning, but um, I do have a photo op. He said, no, just go to your photo op and come back. But what I didn't realise, it was our first first year, so we didn't really know how things worked. Um, first of all, I'll put in my Cooper photo op. I love this picture. I thought this was brilliant. It was a last minute thought, wasn't it? But, and Cooper liked it as well. I'll put up, uh, he liked it and he replied, because I asked him what he thought of our photo op. And he replied on Twitter, yay. And he said, we nailed it, so. <laughs> Then we had a photo op with Denai. Very quick again, but she was, you could tell she was quite reserved, wasn't mm. she? She was, she was a bit just like, hi, hi. And she had a bit of a wardrobe malfunction as oh, we were yeah. in the queue. Very, yeah. So uh, they were sort of tying her top back up. Um, so they just made sure that everything was okay. Because <laughs> we didn't want any accidents in the photos. So then after Denai's photo op, we went back up to Norman's autograph queue. And boy, have we got a story. <laughs> um, not gonna lie, mainly the reason of going to Walker Stalker was to meet Jeff and Norman. Because <laughs> uh, Rick, Daryl and Negan are my three favourite characters from The Walking Dead. Um, or my three male favourite characters. So anyway, we've got up to his autograph line. No one there. No one there. <laughs> Just volunteers and stuff. So uh, we spoke to a volunteer and uh, he said, oh yeah, he's he's done for autographs for the day. Sorry, pardon? What? <laughs> so he said, yeah, um, I said, look, we spoke to Richard in the morning. He said, have your photo ops and come back. And he was like, yeah, I'm, I'm really sorry. I don't know what to say. He's in photo ops. So we went down to Will Call again. We asked to speak to Richard, who we spoke to in the morning and finally got hold of him and explained the situation. And that man, I love that man. He deserves so much recognition. With the emails for all the goals, couldn't be more helpful. Um, cut a long story short, he went back to Norman's management in the middle of the photo ops to then ask Norman if he wouldn't mind signing to photo ops, which Norman did. So I'm so grateful. And we got our photo ops signed. I think it helped that we had stuff for him to sign rather than picking out pictures because obviously they packed him away thank you norman. Um, yes and <laughs> yes and thank you norman for signing, <laughs> signing them um a learning curve on that one so i have to go back next year now to meet him properly properly um but i got my hug and uh you know i got an autograph without being there <laughs> and you always hold on what he said to you yes he called me sweetheart he probably called everyone, every woman sweetheart that day, but I don't care. He called me sweetheart. <laughs> and I'm going to stick with that. Um, but yeah, just goes to show, he, he didn't have to do it. Yes, it was bad communication on both parts, I guess. Um, I didn't say that I had a second photo op. I don't know, you live and learn. But I got my autograph, which I'm so, so happy about. And uh, it's just a, a good excuse to go next year. <laughs> Then we went to see Melissa McBride, aka Carol. Um, she is so sweet, such oh, a sweet woman. I love her. She is, you've really fallen in love with her now. Mm. She's just the sweetest person ever. Very softly spoken, like complete mm. contrast between meeting to character on TV. Yeah. So Shows different. how good of an actress she is then. Oh. <laughs> she suffers with anxiety quite a bit, and I know she was struggling uh, Saturday but I'm still so grateful that she came um, you know she loves the, her fans but she's just not a big fan of crowds so uh, obviously she wasn't doing selfies at her table and I was really shocked her autograph was £35 I was really shocked now she could have charged a hell of a lot more oh, God, but I was really shocked at that so here's our pictures of the autographs that we chose so that was our Walker Stalker experience for London 2018 I'm just, the con blues are crap. Just hearing other people, oh, I'm going to Chicago, you know, I'm going to Germany next week. It's just like, I want to go again. <laughs> but trust me, I need to save now because I'm skint now. Um, yes, it was expensive, 
But do you know what? We don't really go out, especially now we've got the house. And do you know what? Sod it. It was a bloody good experience and I'd do it again tomorrow. If I had the money. <laughs> I, I don't think I'd do it tomorrow. I'd let my feet wear off and catch yeah. up sleep first. I need to sleep and catch up with my sleep. But it was awesome and it was so lovely to see people that I'd been talking to on Facebook in these Facebook groups. And yeah, it was just really nice to, to make new friends. And in any queue that we were, we were always making friends and talking to people in the queue. Everyone was so friendly and so helpful and couldn't fault it. Amazing time. Bring on London 2019. <laughs> or the cruise. I'd love to do the cruise or Atlanta. They are on my bucket list. Yeah. Yes, I know, we did have photo ops with Lauren, but unfortunately she cancelled. Let me know down in the comments, did you go to Walker Stalker London? Or have you been to any other Walker Stalker? Let me know down in the comments, what was your experience like? Who was your favourite person to meet? Mine had to be Jeff. Oh, I love that man. <laughs> <laughs> and who was yours? Um, I'll probably say Pollyanna. Yeah? Yeah, personally. Yeah, she was really nice. Really she's, chatty as well. Yeah, that's what I quite yeah. liked about it. So yeah, I think she was, she was probably my most favourite one. So I will see you Tuesday for my Walking Dead reaction. Cannot wait. And I'm going to leave it there for now. And until next time, check you later. <laughs>